Hello there. Today's video is slightly different because I'd like to introduce you to a new member of my collection. This is a free speed record player made by a company called Shenzhen from China. I thought I'd like to give you a little demonstration of what you do as well as no verdict to tell you what I think of it. you've heard the music playing, I think it's time we had a look at some of the positives and the negatives for this machine. I think we can stay for a star that immediately, he actually does a pretty good job of playing that music. So the sound comes out very rich and warm and occasionally at the lower levels it does wobble but this thing cost £18, remember that. Most record players in my area cost about £40 and you could really ask expect anything better quality at this price range unless you were going for a really well kept original record player but those are getting quite hard to find and aside from the cheapness it's also a very light machine so you could easily pick this up with pick this up and move it around somewhere now unfortunately we have to look at some of the negatives of this machine now you might have noticed I've put tulips from Amsterdam back on the record player. This is to demonstrate a little fault with this record player. Now most record players, when they get to the end of a song, will reset the needle arm back to the holster where it is. Shall we watch what happens when we turn this on? Oh dear. That's not the only issue with this machine. I don't know if you noticed it. This machine isn't exactly made out of the most expensive materials either. 
the plastics are very cheap and honestly I think the last time I saw something like that I was eating Tic Tacs out of it and the wood itself is medium density fiberboard and if that gets wet that's not going to be very good for the machinery inside because it will just swell up and expand and disintegrate like sawdust. Look, not a good thing to have on a record player. Now, my final verdict on this box. I have to say it's a bit of a mixed bag here. It's not a machine that you're particularly going to put on display in your because it's a little bit... The design isn't bad, but it's not one you'd want to show off to people at parties or anything like that. But I have to say, the music works pretty well, so if you just want to relax with a book and listen to a record, this machine actually does a pretty good job. So overall, if you're thinking of buying a record player, just don't be put off by something that looks a little bit ugly, because you might find that an ugly little record player might still play a very beautiful sound.